Hi there, I'm Michael Posnick from Century 21 Northumberland here in Prince Edward Island, Canada. And today our video is titled, Why You Should Buy in Sunbury Cove Estates. This is part number six of our multi-part series on why you should consider driving down and taking a look at Sunbury Cove Estates. Um, there's five other videos prior to this, obviously. You might want to take the time to check those out and check any videos out that are made after this. Uh, you can get all the updates at sunburycove.com and make sure you uh, join the mailing list and when you watch the YouTube videos, uh, subscribe and then you'll get uh, updates as, uh, as new stuff comes out. So what we're talking about today is how Sunbury Cove is unique from any other luxury community in Prince Edward Island and how it's unique is number one and we covered this in a previous video is it's accessible only by one 3.2 kilometer two mile road that only goes to the uh, to the estate and it's a government road uh, so it goes down to the estate um, the estate in total is about 240 acres and it's surrounded with uh, 200 acres actually let me step back the subdivision itself that's been subdivided into the extra large lots is about 40 to 45 acres so then above that we have an additional 200 acres that's sitting dormant that's all forested and surrounded uh, by water on the one side we have a freshwater stream on that would be on the west side on the southeast side we have a bay and then on the other side of course we have the ocean or the uh, the strait um, and from from that you would have a view of two lighthouses the confederation bridge and on a, um, a non-humidity cool day you could see new brunswick way out in the distance as well so we have a 200 acre buffer we we have on our property and then over and above that there's probably another thousand or more acres that's uh, mainly wooded so the property is surrounded by a red sandy beach you can and there is some white sandy dunes almost around a wetland at the eastern tip you'll see in the aerial photos at sunburycove.com it's extremely private uh, obviously being miles from the closest road and the closest road is paved um, but it's a it's a tourist touristy route or it's a road used by the locals it's not the main highway so there's really no noise on the road and certainly when you're 3.2 kilometers away from it there's absolutely no noise it is so quiet you can hear a pin drop it's amazing um, there's no uh, how would you put this uh, a lot of times you know you look at uh, waterfront real estate PEI and it's surrounded by a bunch of old derelict cottages that have been there for a hundred years and that was the thing at the time I mean people would chop up this land and you know waterfront properties in these little 0.1 or 0.2 acre lots and build these little shacks with their buddies on the weekend over a couple cases of beer in Sunbury Cove Estates you won't find any of that all the structures are new the subdivision was only started in 07 and our restrictive and protective covenants make sure that the uh, the properties that go in there have some minimal standards and square footage and uh, you can find that information on the website as well. Now that doesn't mean you have to build a multi-million dollar home. It just means certain things like uh, vinyl siding aren't allowed. Uh, you need a minimum square footage. Um, you know. But getting back to the property, which is the subject of this video, um, you can walk the beach for miles and miles. When I initially photographed this site for marketing purposes, it took me about five and a half hours and I don't think I covered a third of it. So, I mean, there's plenty of places to walk. We have walking trails in there. There's three accesses to the beach. Um, the freshwater stream that runs along the western side, you can probably jump over or walk through. It's only about a foot or foot deep. Um, uh, so, of course, you know, there's foxes, raccoons, there's rabbits, um, there's swimming. Um, there, the bay is probably the best place if you are going to have a boat or you're going to get into any water sports. The nice thing is that we do have a bay that's completely protected uh, from the wind and undercurrents or whatever, which is really a fantastic feature of the property. Um, there's a natural uh, wetland way out on the eastern portion, eastern tip, 
Uh, you see a lot of birds that like to congregate there. You'll even see the odd bald eagle on the estate. Uh, of course, some of the things that uh, people like to do in that area is kayaking, boating, uh, in the winter cross-country skiing, and uh, the the location was known uh, prior to us developing it is probably one of the best places on on that part of the island for uh, uh, bar clams. So uh, when we initially purchased the property, the you know it was inundated with people uh, parking at the uh, uh, the tip there to uh, to pick out bar clams. And of course, around it you have oyster leases as well. So, you know, it's a happening place. Anyway, all I ask is if you are coming to PEI or you're in PEI and you're looking for quality waterfront, take the time to drive down to Sunbury Cove Estates. You know, all the information, geo GPS coordinates, directions, maps, and everything can be found at Sunbury Cove Estates. Make sure you subscribe to this video on YouTube and make sure you join our mailing list when you get to the website. Have a great day. Bye for now.